you guys welcome back to another video today i wanted to just bring you through a productive morning with me you guys know i love my morning routine this isn't necessarily like a morning routine but i just thought it'd be fun to hang out spend the morning together so of course first things first i'm just making my iced coffee this is the most elite combo it is so good it's my favorite i look forward to making my coffee every single morning I swear, it's not even the taste of coffee that I crave, it's the process of making it. It's just like therapeutic and I love it. So, making my coffee to wake me up this morning. you can see how messy my room is this morning so first things first I just made my bed making the bed instantly makes my room look so much more neat and also I like to do this in the morning because it just makes me feel very productive because it's just like one little simple easy task and like I said it just makes you feel accomplished one thing done and then I just decided to put away all these clothes that were on my floor because I had a load of laundry and it needed to just put all these away so I like to freshen up my space whether it's my bedroom or my entire apartment in the morning because I had extra time today and also I work from home so I like to make sure that my space is clear and decluttered so that my mind isn't just like cluttered and overwhelmed And then I figured, you know what, I'm on a roll, might as well just get my laundry done too because I'm gonna be heading to the gym anyways and I could have my laundry going while I'm working out. See, it's all about convenience, people. Work smarter, not harder. got ready for the gym I threw on this biker short set from set active and then my on cloud sneakers which I have been obsessed with lately and of course got the gym essentials my keys little nut and seed bar airpods of course and then my water Before I head into the shower and get ready for the day, I wanted to show you guys this little loungewear set that I was wearing this morning. These, oh my gosh, you guys, I cannot get over how much I love these joggers and like little top from Cozy Earth. I wore them in a vlog, I think like a week or so ago, and so many of you guys were wondering where they were from. The brand is Cozy Earth. They sell such premium like pajamas, loungewear. Also, they have bedding as well, which I need to get my hands on because they have temperature regulating sheets. All of their products are temperature regulating because they're made from super soft viscose material from highly sustainable bamboo. And bamboo is 50% more moisture wicking than cotton. So you're not like overheating as you would with like cotton sheets or cotton pajamas, which is why I can wear this whole set sleeping at night. So comfy. Also, I just love pajama sets and loungewear sets. You guys know if you watch my vlogs and keep up with my videos. I have worn this set probably like 10 times since I've gotten it and thrown it in the wash a bunch and it does not pill. Like you can see the quality of these pants. They're insane. They're made with enhanced weave quality. So like I said, they don't pill. Black joggers are like a staple in my closet. And I especially like these ones because it's sustainable and I love it because it's not made with like any harsh chemicals or dyes and it is so comfy. Like you get the most quality sleep ever. We all need our beauty sleep. So I definitely recommend it. Checking out Cozy Earth. I'll have a link down below. You guys can head over to CozyEarth.com slash Snyder and get 40% off 
your entire purchase, which is such a freaking good deal. All right, I just freshened up and got out of the shower, changed into some comfy clothes because I kind of want to just have a chill morning and be a little productive until I had to work this afternoon. Don't have too much going on, but I'm gonna let my skin breathe today. I just did my skincare. So this is literally what I'm gonna be looking like all day today because like I said, I want my skin to breathe. I've been dealing pretty badly with some breakouts recently and I don't know what's going on. I'm not on my period. I'm not like stressed out or anything because I know that when you have um, breakouts on your chin, it's like stressed induced and then when it's on your cheek, it's more like hormonal acne, but I'm not like dealing with that. So I'm trying to trying to figure it out. But anyways, I'll show you guys my quick acne skincare routine. So I've been using this cleanser recently. It's the Laneige Cream Skin Milk Oil Cleanser. I really like it, it's super gentle. That's why I love milk cleansers because they're gentle and also they make your skin like baby freaking soft. And especially when I'm putting like acne related products on my face, um, it makes my skin very dry, so I like to use that to keep it extra moisturized and soft looking. Then this is the secret sauce. It's the Biogio Be Well 100% tea tree oil. Freaking love this stuff because tea tree oil is so good for like acne. So what I do is I just like dab it on my finger and then dot it on like my active breakouts. Then once that dries up and soaks into my skin, I use the um, Drunk Elephant Retinol Cream. Just put this all over my face. Retinol, great ingredient for your skin, whether you're dealing with acne or not. It just helps like really just like tighten up your face and also helps with um, fine lines and wrinkles if you have that going on. And then lastly, I just take this Medicube Red Cream um, moisturizer and put that all over my face. So that is the acne skincare routine. So. Anyways, I'm just going to go make some breakfast right now because I'm so hungry and then I'll see you guys in a little bit. This morning for breakfast, I just made a yogurt parfait. So I did some Greek yogurt, bananas, and then frozen berries in my favorite granola from Purely Elizabeth. It's the dark chocolate sea salt granola. So incredible, but I'm just gonna eat this and then watch some YouTube and kind of chill out and then we'll like plan and do all of that. The blue light glasses are on, so that's when you know it's grind time. But basically right now I'm gonna spend a few minutes just planning my week. It's Wednesday, but I like to do um, kind of like a planning for the weekend and everything on Wednesday in terms of like content. So. I know that tomorrow I'm going to be taking Instagram photos, so I'm just going to like scroll on Pinterest for a little bit and get some like inspo, maybe of like places I could go to take photos or different like poses to do and stuff and save those to refer to. And then I also need to plan out some videos that I'm going to do. I like to plan my videos in advance so that I kind of have like an idea of what I want the video concept to be and so that it has kind of like a meaning behind it because I said that, I think I said it in a few vlogs ago, that I really want every video I post to have depth to it and like a why behind the vlog. I don't want it to just be like me shopping and showing you guys like a haul or random stuff like that, like showing you guys my skincare and being like yada yada yada, I don't know. I just think I want my vlogs, like I said, to have more depth and more connection with you guys. So I like to make sure that there's good quality content going into each video and I'm not just like randomly whipping out my camera and vlogging. I got this from Target. It is a holy grail savior. I love this planner so much because before each week it has a lined paper. So um, I'll like plan out the videos on there because I want to start posting two videos a week. So on one page I'll plan one video and then the other page I'll plan the other video and then also I'll like write down TikToks that I want to make and post throughout the week. And then, yeah, that's kind of it. Sometimes things do just like come spur of the moment, especially like TikToks and stuff. Um, so it's not like set in stone, but like I said, I kind of like to have an idea of how my week looks and I'll plan workouts when I work. 
um, when I'm going to vlog, all of that. Also, a huge thing in my life right now going on is studying for my group fitness certification, and I've been doing that a little bit. You guys have probably seen me study here and there in my vlogs, but I have been starting to get so serious now about like studying, so I printed off a bunch of flashcards, and this is only three chapters, you guys. I have 12 chapters of flashcards that I have to go through, and honestly, I like forgot how to study. Like, studying is something I kind of forgot how to do, so um, I need to start planning out what I'm going to really focus and like hone in on studying these. I want to start doing like an hour or two hours a day, so that's kind of what I'm going to do um, this morning is just like kind of plan out my week and all of that, which I highly recommend. It's a little bit later, it's 11.33 right now and I'm just about to head out to work. So I wanted to show you guys kind of like everything that I pack with me in my work bag. I work at Orange Theory if you're new here. Um, but I'm gonna bring my planner with me because I bring this thing everywhere I go. And then my flashcards so I can study for my group fitness test. Um, and just study these like when there's some downtime at my computer, of course. And then my chlorophyll water because I'm trying to keep this habit up. Chlorophyll is like insanely good for you. And honestly, this does not taste bad. I know it looks intimidating, it's this like insanely dark green, but it has this like very subtle peppermint taste. I just used this one that I got on Amazon, and yeah, it's pretty good. It's like nothing crazy. And then I'm gonna bring a little snack with me. This is just a protein cookie, and these are so, so, so yummy. So that's everything that I bring with me to work. Nothing too exciting. Anyways, on that note, I'm going to end off this video here. I hope you guys enjoyed spending the morning with me. If you liked this type of video, definitely let me know and I can film like a morning routine or something in the future for you guys. But I love you all so much and I will see you in my next video. Bye guys.